Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another quiz. This is the th hashtag three, I think. And today it's going to be themed around once upon a time because as you are watching this, it is returning tonight as I am filming tomorrow. And you may very well know that it is one of my favourite programmes. So let's get on with the quiz. And of course, because I'm practically the biggest once upon a time fan. I have took some of these quizzes before but not these ones. So basically they're all very stereotypical once upon a time questions. So if you don't like that, tough watch anyway. Number one, do you believe in magic? Yes, because if you haven't watched the show, yeah, basically. What the second question is, what is your choice of weapon? No weapons for me, a sword, a bow and arrow, a gun or magic. I would definitely like to have magic but I don't so I'm going to go with bow and arrow. Which of these colours do you prefer? Black, purple, white or red? Purple. Next question is, what's your favourite season of Once Upon a Time? That's the hardest question. I had to put my laptop down for this because I've got some serious thinking to do. One, I find quite boring. Two, is all hella evil queen. Three, is when they go to Neverland and I hate Peter Pan. Literally, that was the scary season for me. I know it might seem quite wumpy, but I really don't like Peter Pan or Neverland. Um, what happened in 3B? can't quite remember. Oh no. Someone tell me that in the comments. And then season 4 was Frozen. Yes. And then it was The Queens of Darkness. Which was a bit like on a tangent kind of. But there was quite a lot of Captain Swan. And then season 5 was The Dark One and then Rescuing Hook from the Underworld. I apologise if I just ruined everything for you. But I'm going to go with season 4. Right, while my laptop's just doing whatever it's doing, buffering, I'm going to go through theories. Because I have a good theory for this show. Right. Could be absolutely, completely wrong. But I think Emma Swan is pregnant. Or she's going to get pregnant. Because we know Dr. Wells returning. He gave, he helped um, Zelina give birth to her baby and Snow give birth her baby so why not help Emma and also Dr Archibald Hopper Jiminy Cricket is returning and we know that he has a new patient and the fans are that clever we figured out it's Emma because we're not stupid and we've also seen preview pictures where Emma has been wearing instead of a red leather jacket a black leather jacket which is the same as Hook's so I think she's pregnant, she doesn't want to tell Hook or her parents or Gina or Henry or anyone. So she's gone to actual Topper for help. And she's got Killian's jacket because she's pregnant, therefore she's clingy and she wants his jacket. And then in the preview that came out, I think when you're watching this three days ago, um, it was the one where they were practically making out on the couch and she was there panically like where's Henry, where's my parents, where's Regina, should I take my jacket off, is this okay and everything so I think maybe she got pregnant in season 5 and season 6 is like a journey that could be completely wrong but I'm pretty sure she's going to get pregnant at some stage so we'll leave it at that Next question is, who is the worst parent on Once Upon a Time? So does Cara or Peter Pan? I mean, how do you choose? Peter Pan abandoned his child for magic. And Cara kept a child but made a suffer with magic. Because she killed her boyfriend, which was one of the worst. Um, there's been horrible stuff. Sorry about that noise. My laptop keeps making noise. Cause... There we go again. Um, and again. Shut up, please. 
Anyway, Cora has put her daughter through literal hell because she hated being with her, but she couldn't leave the castle, she couldn't leave the realm, she had to stay where she was put. So I'm gonna go for Cara. Okay, what is love? Weakness, strength, power, or sacrifice? Sacrifice, cause um, outlaw queen. Yeah. Who is your OTP? Well, that's a dumb question. Captain Swan, Snow Wing, Rumble, Rum, uh, Rumble, or outlaw queen? Captain Swan, obviously. Who is the best villain? Oh, this is tricky. Rumpelstiltskin, Peter Pan, Hades. Queens of Darkness, Cara, Zelina. Right. Okay. Zelina's off the list because she's turned nice now. So she can't stay a villain for long. The Queens of Darkness has got a picture of Maleficent, Ursula and Cruella. But I feel like Ursula and Cruella just follow Maleficent's lead. So when Maleficent found out that Lily was alive and then Emma went to get Lily, I feel like they're out of the villain category. Cara, she was defeated by her own daughter. So, no. Because if your own daughter is a worse villain than you, then you're off the villainous list. Peter Pan also got defeated by his son. Hades got defeated by his girlfriend. So, therefore, Rumpelstiltskin is the worst villain. In the end, oh, I've got... Snow White, which I am quite happy with because I love Snow White and Mary Margaret and Jennifer Goodwin. Right, okay, seeing as this is a special quiz, once upon a time special quiz, I'm going to be doing a second one, that is for a second one. Um, so this is called What Once Upon a Time Character Said What? And I have a feeling already this is going to be much harder. Because I do pay attention, but this is going to be so much harder. Right, the first one is, you want darkness, I will give you darkness. Ursula, Rumpelstiltskin, Maleficent or Regina. Now my gut instinct was Regina, but I don't know why. I'm just going to go with Regina because that's all I can think of. I was wrong. It was Maleficent. It is a sad truth that the people closest to us are the ones most capable of causing us the most pain. I feel like that's quite deep and meaningful. So the snow, rumple, hook or Regina. Snow is always the most deep meaning things like everything she says has a second meaning so I'm going to go with snow. Are you joking? I was wrong again. Right, I'm, I'm going to get this one. Sometimes the hero finally makes the right choice, but is the wrong thing, oh, wrong timing. And as they say, timing is everything. I've heard that before. Timing is everything. That's Rumpelstiltskin. It's not. It's Peter Pan. Oh, but that's his son. So I was close. Okay, you see, I am a truly terrible person. Ursula, Rumpel, Snow or Cruella de Vil. Snow's not a terrible person, so let's um, get her out of it. Ursula, Rumpel, or Cruella. I think it's Cruella because she tried to kill Henry and she wanted to make it clear to Emma that she was her. Let's go with that. I was right! Oh, yay. Hmm. Now, may I resume killing her? Emma and Snow can get out of it. Oh, I didn't tell you the options. Regina, Delina, Snow, or Emma. Snow and Emma have never killed anyone on the show. That's not true, Emma has, but it's not Emma. So it's Regina or Zelina. Zelina has not actually killed anyone on the snow. On the snow? On the show. So it's Regina. Correct. Oh, this one's so easy. Don't worry, Anna, I will find you. So that's Elsa, but I'll tell you the options. Elsa, Kristoff, Belle or Regina. Elsa. Oh my god, it's not. <laughs> it's Belle. I know that now. I remember Belle saying, I'm such an idiot. This one is hella easy. And if I get this wrong, I'm going to be mad. Good will win. Oh, it's not so easy anymore, actually, now I think about it. Snow, Henry, Regina, or Emma. It's not Regina because she's not good, she's evil. 
Snow Henry Emma, see, that saying has always been Snow's saying. But Emma's a daughter, so now Emma believes in that saying, and Henry's her son, so now Henry believes in that saying, and I'm going to go with Henry because he's the last on the line. Please be right. Yeah, it was Henry. A man unwilling to fight for what he wants deserves what he gets. Rumpel, Emma, Regina or Hook. A man who willing to fight for what he wants deserves what he gets. Willing to fight for what he wants. Rumpel, unwilling to fight for what he wants. I feel like Rumpel said that to Hook. I was wrong. It was Hook that said it to Rumpel. No. When people are supposed to be together, they find a way. <coughs> Charming, Belle, Snow or Mulan. So obviously Charming and Snow, they're the Snow and Couple. It'll most likely be them. But which one of them said it? When people are supposed to be together, they find a way. I'm going to go for Charming, but I think it's Snow. It was Snow. Why did I do that? You will marry this girl, or I will kill you. Regina, King George, Ingrid, or Hans. So that's obviously King George, because he's mean. And that's the last question. And I got four right out of ten. Go with me. And it says, well, you could do a little better, couldn't you? So that is the end of the video, I hope you really really liked this quiz that I just did, please tune in to Once Upon a Time and if you haven't before, make sure you watch it from season 1 otherwise it's going to be a bit all over the place. But anyway, thank you for watching this video and I will see you next Thursday with another video, goodbye!